Uh, we're getting games going. Names are correct, everything's fine. I don't have my name as a commentator. Let's fix that. Anyway, uh, last time these two played, Muse I won. I believe it was 2 1. It was in winner's quarters of 4 stock clover. I don't remember which 4 stock clover, but it was a 4 stock clover. And the winner of this plays me, I'm sitting in loser semis. In loser's finals, we have Count Gooby. And then winner side grands, we have Dexter. So that's how bracket's gonna look like. Everything's pretty much all set. And all of those matches should be streamed, unless for some reason somebody refuses to play on stream. I don't know why that would happen. It's never happened before, not with this setup anyway. But we'll see. Ooh, I thought that was gonna be a knee. Instead, he goes for the patient option, waits, gets a back air, that's actually very smart. Oh, and he got the balloon. He's gonna win now, he has to. He's ahead in balloon count. Yep. Good ledge hog. Wasn't much music I could have done there. Ooh, I'm surprised he didn't try to grab after that. Keep on just sitting in shield. Donkey Punch is charged. Oh no. Oh, doesn't get the tech chase. Muzi, I know before the set, you mentioned that he might be a little bit tilted. But after some of his melee sets and the 1pm set that he had went rather poorly. I feel a bit upset about that, but he should be happy. He actually made very good upsets in both PM and melee today. PM he beat Jax, who's number 4 on RPR. And he's like beats Deepak here, he might be looking at a PR spot next season himself. She is that forward air. He just goes out and does it. He calls out the jump, that was so smart. Wavelands from Muzai, they're baiting me out even. Unfortunately, he doesn't get too much from it. It's an air debuff in good position for an edge guard. Wow, that was interesting. It looked like it should have traded, but it didn't. Oh, there's the punch. He's alive, but. Make it back. He does. The balloon kind of slows down Deepak. I don't think it mattered. Oh, he gets a tech chase. That's probably going to be a stock. Nope, there's an air. He's not dead yet. All right. He's that sitting at a crisp 151%. That backer is going to be enough. No, it's not. Jeez. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, that was that was so close. 
help. There's an air. Oh, weak knee. Good little combo there. He's got to get an edge guard, though. Aggressive option from Deepak, saving him. He's like, probably dead here. Yep. He doesn't have his jump. He refreshes it, though, with the use of the Falcon Kick, but he's still dead. Fox should get one ban here. It's one ban. One ban. Best of five. Should have told him that before he banned the second stage, but... Okay, Musa did go there anyway, so... The second ban perhaps would not have mattered as much. I love this song, by the way. I love Celeste as a game, but... That's not what we're talking about today. Yeah, that almost as entertaining as a Celeste speedrun. Oh, a wave land. Yep. Standard Donkey Kong stuff. Deepak's punish game is very, very good. He's beaten some of the best in the state with it before. Of course, he's also susceptible to losing to uh, players, you know, not on RPR, such as Musai right here. Two knees. Get this stupid gorilla out of here. Oh, that wave lands. I really like Musai's movement. It doesn't seem to be mattering too much in the grand scheme of things, but like, you know, the little wave lands start like... It's for spacing and like baiting stuff out. If he could work it into his play a little bit better, I think it would help him a lot. Oh, he wants to monitor the reverse strong knee. That would have been sick. He might be dead. Nope. The aggressive option comes out. I believe I got Gooby. I'm Gooby joining me on commentary. Hello. Uh, okay. I like the coverage. Yeah, oh, no grab follow up. Surprised he got it for the dash. Okay. okay. Yeah, currently, the set count is 1-0 in Deepak's favor. Okay. I think what Deepak's gonna wanna do is try to stump him out as best as possible, and use his air to get him like this guy. Yeah. Get oh, cargo. Oh my. Oh, oh, he just up, does it. That was a... S no, he, I think he would've made it back. Shoutouts to Noodles, by the way. Sponsor us. Got some... Fresh Japanese pan noodles. We're sponsored by noodles now? Okay. Only at noodles and should not be monthly. Can you get these delicious pan noodles eaten by Count Gooby himself? Okay, but Gooby. I wanted to say it while it was like when it actually did it in the song, but I missed it. <laughs> You're all good. Oh my gosh. Uh, it's gonna be a zero oh. death? Wow. So one thing I noticed oh my. that is that that dash attack. Uh, yeah. Something that the dev team did about that, compared from his brawl, like, counterpart, is that um, that doesn't go, like, off the ledge in brawl. Oh, okay. What I do is have that inspired by Donkey Kong Country. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it goes off the ledge like that. That's you know, a neat. Yeah. Musai brings it right back with a combo of his own. That's some, like, PM trivia for you that they, a lot of the PM dev team will inspire their, like, their characters based on past games and sometimes mechanics and, like, Donkey Kong. I like that. Kind of like a labor of love, if you will. Yeah. Pay homage exactly. to there it is right there. some games. Oh, you that did was, not want that. That was some spaghetti. You definitely did not want a spot dodge there. You've there got noodles, but that was some spaghetti. <laughs> that be our, like, our motto. 
Oh yeah, there wouldn't have been an option he could have put out, so... Um, shoutouts to uh, Donkey Kong's horrible vertical recovery. He just kind of died at like 30. Yeah. Oh, the read! You get, That's a need, no, he missed. If you get DK too low, then it's like, well, rip. Good? Up there. I'm surprised Deepak is missing these grabs. There's one. There it is. Yep. He did have too early, I believe. He used Ice Tech, saved him. Yep. Still was invulnerable from the tech animation. Yeah, that was interesting. I've seen that happen a lot. Oh, there's a jab. Oh. Let's grab him. I like Deepak's double down air, like, you know, drop coverage. I think that's good for, like, catching people off guard. It's, uh... This is a really back and forth game. This is cool. Yeah. Uh oh, here's a grab. We'll see what he gets off it. Oh. Oh. Okay. I think he expected. Yeah, he must have expected Musa to go to the platform. Musa said option not yeah. to. Oh. He's still getting hit though. This might just no. be it. We'll see what no Deepak can come up with. Yeah, I'm surprised. That's a, I was thinking. Okay. Oh, that's a back air. That's pretty, that's gonna do it. Okay, that makes sense. The winner is. I'm surprised Deepak went for that option, like instead of the Nair, because I would have done Nair to try to get better position. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I heard you clearing your throat for it. I'm like, I know. I know. Stop it. Shout out to Smash as well. We are going to Pokemon Stadium 2. Also, oh, excellent song yet again. Yes. This is a very good music pack. Shout out to the whoever put this music pack together for Smash and Splash. Yeah, there's credits in the um, yeah. files. We're using the Smash and Splash build, the Push More Buttons build was like, it's super unstable. <laughs> I tried to fix it, but it's just, no. It's not having it. I'm probably gonna have to remake it from scratch. This is a good build. Yeah, it's a really good build. Shoutouts to Wild, he's the one who made it. Fellow Sonic main. Surprised, um, you side in Op for down air through platform to poke him. Yeah. Oh, he wanted, feel like he wanted ledge, but there's already a hitbox. I feel like DK is big enough to where he could do that. You know, like DK could do a similar thing also. He could stick his foot like through the platform. Yeah. Deepak turned that sucker around super fast. Oh. Not quite dead. Again, Musa tries to go to ledge, oh. but the hitbox from the up he stuffs him. Yeah. <laughs> These back airs. That's weak me. Oh no. Weak knee sometimes all you need, but in that case, really he when he just went too low for it. Yeah, there's the knee. It's still totally doable though. Yeah, I would say, I would say so too, because like the punish games were just like super, super strong with both players and characters. Oh my. Yeah, he was going for a really hard beat there. He was thinking he was going to just fall right into that up smash, but yeah, that's what happened. Oh, that was some spaghetti. Shield drop up air would have been kind of interesting. Alright, there's a the grab after the crowd cancel, and he's not Cut quite dead. It's going to be an edge card. Up smash. I don't even think that would have hit. That was really good. That was I like that. Super smart. The Nair was really good pressure and he kind of faded like he could have opted to fade anyway and he kind of stood like faded a little back. I don't know, I like it. Yep. Alright. Jabs into grab and he's I almost took the lead in percent. It's those subtle things that can make a difference. Indeed. Especially with like these players are so close in terms of skill level I feel. Yeah, it's, is interesting. You can have some days where you could be like, you can super, super good. And do like oh. that, like wreck, yeah. wreck people like Yeah. I mean, he beat Jax today. Yeah. Granted, that set was full of spaghetti, but he's, I mean, he still did it. Jax is uh, very good. Number four in RPR. No. Number five. Well, something like that. Number five. But he just has moments. Like, he'll have a tournament where he'll do that. Yeah. It's like, it's once in a blue moon. Oh, he saved his jump. Barely able to get back to ledge. I would say this is like a consistency thing. He's got to somehow get back. He's able to land on stage, but another backer coming out from Deepak. Oh no, he wanted ledge. And that'll, that'll do it. 3 1 Deepak, and I'm up now. Have fun, dude. I'll try. <laughs> You're welcome to commentate. If you could run stream for me, that'd be really helpful. Yeah, Thanks.